Hey, Jim. Larson, this is the third time this has happened. You gonna pay me for your rent or not? I, I, I'll pay the rent, Jim. I just got fired, man. I I called Twitter X. I mean, I called X Twitter, even though it's called Twitter. I don't know. Elon got on to me. I'm sorry, man. I'll, I'll get the rent to you. Just give me a couple days. You have two days. Thanks, Jim. Well, Larson, what'd you do this time? You know my life. It's just one problem after another, man. I'm, just, I'm so frustrated. I, I don't know what I'm going to do. It's... Get in the car, and then you can tell me all about it. So what's really bothering you? Are you serious? What's not wrong? It, it's... It's not just the car, is it? Sure, Sherlock. You got it. Hey, don't be snippy with me. I'm just trying to help. I know. I'm sorry. I'm just... Things are really going bad for me right now, you know. I got fired last week. Netflix won't let me share accounts anymore. And my, my landlord even threatened to evict me. So I just don't know where my life's going. I don't know what I'm going to do. The, man, don't say that. Like, things are going to get better. I don't think so. My life is a mess. I wonder why God hates me. God doesn't hate you. Yeah, right. <laughs> Do you mind if I pray for you? Sure. Come to me, all you who are weary and heavy laden, and I will give you rest. All of you, take up my yoke and learn from me, because I am gentle and lowly in heart, and you will find rest for yourselves. For my yoke is easy and my burden is light. Come on in. The really important thing that I want you guys to get from this verse is that all that we need in this life is Jesus. There was a time in my life where I was restless, I was hopeless, I had anxiety, I was tired, and uh, Jesus took all of that away. And now my problems and struggles didn't just pass away and all of them vanish, but now I found strength in Christ. I found courage in Christ. I was able to pursue through these trials and to persevere through them. And if you are here today and thinking my life has no meaning, you know, my life has no purpose, then you can turn to Jesus and you need a Savior. Star Wars guy? Yeah, my friend Clark sold me those. Oh, I like them. Hey, thanks again for letting me stay. I really appreciate it. No problem. Stay as long as you need. So, Larson, how are you doing? Well, to tell you the truth, man, I'm, I'm tired. You know, I'm just, I'm tired of running around. I'm tired of worrying about everything. I'm tired of trying to be what the world expects me to be. And, and it's just making me angry and bitter. It, everything around me. I just, I don't know what to do. Oh yeah? Yeah, like the only time I felt calmness was when you prayed for me that time. And then when I went to the Bible study when I really didn't want to go, whenever that pastor started speaking, like, I don't know why, I just something, felt something inside and I just, I don't know what it was. Do you remember what verse he was talking about the other day? No, I don't. Well, it was from Matthew 11, verses 28 through 30. And it said, 
Come to me, all who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. Larson, that's what you need. You need rest. And the only way you're going to find it is if you come to God, if you lay it all out for Him and trust Him. It, it can be that easy. It is that easy. All right, God, you win. I, I'm tired and I, I just need rest. I, I don't know how to do this praying thing, but God, I hope you can accept this prayer. I just, I need Jesus. So God, I'm, I'm here. Just help me. Larston, Larkin, hold on. I think, Larston, I think he's calling my name. Let me go see. Larston, hey, it, it's Larson. It's Larson. Oh man, I'm sorry. so sorry. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. I hope you have a Merry Christmas. No, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Well, this I asked for almond milk. That's not almond milk. You you asked for almond yeah, milk. Yeah, that might be like whole or two percent. That that's not almond milk. Sarav, remake. They must have hired a new guy or something. He's, he's different. Mm, that's not any good at all. Uh, anyways, what, what did you want to tell me? I feel it. You feel it? Like, what are you talking about? Prayer. I finally knelt in and I prayed and I just feel so much at peace. What? That's so awesome, Larson. I'm so happy for you. This is what I've been praying for for so long. Thank you. Thank you so much for praying for me. You know, I, for so long, I tried to do it on my own and find that happiness and peace without God. But no matter how hard I tried, I just couldn't find it. And I'm, I'm telling you, when I prayed, something happened. I know. That's what I've been trying to tell you. Many people seek rest and peace in the world, but true peace can only be found in Jesus. And you found that rest in Jesus. I realize that now. You know, I, I feel like something just took a heavy weight off my chest. Like it was there and now it's it's gone. And you know, I was trying everything, but. Jesus did that for you. He does it for everyone who comes to him. He takes away our burdens. Wow, I'm so thankful Jesus did that for me. I'm so warm inside that even though I just have so many things going on. Because God is on your side. Thank you, thank you. You know, I know we're in this coffee shop right now, but would you pray for me? Absolutely. Dear Lord, thank you so much for the rest you give us. Thank you for salvation. I'm headed for the Bible study in a few minutes. Do you want to come? Let's go. What? I didn't get my coffee. Thine only know. Jesus paid it all. See?